Hello, everyone. How are you doing? Hello, sir. Good evening. Good evening. I thought my audio or my microphone wasn't working because I didn't hear you. <laughs> okay. How are you doing, Wendy? Hello, Carlos Roberto. Today, you, uh, Carlos Roberto was the first one in connecting. Yeah. Hello, Edwin. Wendy? No audio? Oh. But you may use the chat, okay? Okay. Hello, teacher. Hello, Edwin. How are you doing? Very nice teacher. Okay. Good evening, everyone. Good evening, Giovanni. How are you doing? Is it everything okay? Very good teacher. Okay, nice to hear. Okay, guys, I think we are going to start because we have a lot to do tonight. Okay. So um I'm going to start with taking the attendance. Okay, let me go there. Anna, Chris, uh, wait, 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 wait. Good evening. Good evening, Silvio. How was your day today? It's fine. Nice, nice. You ready for the class? Yes. Okay, great. Hello, Wani. I see Wendy. Hello, teacher. Hello, Wani. How are you doing? Listen. <laughs> okay. More or, more or less. Okay, more or less. Uh, do you feel well? I mean, are you mm. sick or something? Do you feel not good? Mm, my man, more or less. Uh, okay. Okay. Sí. Pero estoy, ya que hoy voy a recibir. <laughs> Okay, nice, nice. Thank you. Okay. Thank you, Okay. Let's see. Uh, Wendy doesn't have audio tonight, so she's going to be participating by the chat, okay? So please, everybody, let's be um, aware of the chat, okay? Now, mm, I was going to take the attendance, right? Okay, let's start. Ana Chavarria Flores. Ani, Ana del Carmen Mejia Álvarez. Present teacher. Okay. Ana Delmi Herrera Morales. Carlos Alberto Meléndez Rosales. Carlos Eduardo Maldonado Vázquez. Present. Okay. Carlos Roberto García Ramírez. Present teacher. Okay, Daniel Enrique Orellana Mejía. Edwin Eliseo Orellana Vivas. Present teacher. Giovanni Alexander Pineda Romero. Present teacher. Giovanni Alexander Ramirez Sánchez. Present teacher. Juan Carlos Palacios Ramirez. Um, Karina Noemí Álvarez Mejía, Carla Verónica Suria López, Kevin Antonio Ramírez Sánchez, Linda Stephanie Ramírez Ábrego, Nancy Betova Rivera, Silvio Enrique Cortés Flores, Present teacher. Suleima Verónica Melgar Díaz. Wendy Xiomara Núñez. Okay, there she says pre present by the chat. Present okay. teacher. Okay, Ani, Ana Cristina, one second. I'm going to check you in. Okay, I marked it. There we are. I did check it. So. 
we're gonna start tonight with the same thing. We have to see the objective for tonight. Um, but first of all, what I need you to think is how do we use the demonstrative uh, pronouns? Uh, these are words that are used to substitute the, the uh, subject, okay? And they become a subject. We are going to see one of the usages, okay? We're gonna see tonight one of the usages of uh, these pronouns, okay? The pronouns here, we have to be careful with plural and singular, okay? So we are going to start practicing the uh, a, a little conversation, okay? It's a little conversation for us to see how to use those pronouns. Okay, gonna start by showing that. Okay, here we've got it. I don't know why this thing moves a lot. Oh, yeah, I know this, but it is okay. Trying to close this. Now we are better. Oops. I want to practice this conversation, okay? This is when we introduce a third person, okay? Or we talk about, okay, let's see, someone is sending a message. Okay, or for example, when you want to introduce or talk about a, a third person in the conversation, okay? For example, I'm talking to Silvio, uh, and then I want to introduce Giovanni to Silvio, right? And there we use these pronouns. Let's see how do we use that, okay? So we have three people here talking. And they say, hello, this is my friend, Carla. Hi, nice to meet you, Carla. Then there is another one, okay, in uh, the group. And you say, this is my friend Francisco. Then we want to talk to Francisco and Francisco, do you know Edward? Okay, Edward is not there. Yes, that's my friend too, okay? Edward is not there. Then we use, that's my friend too. So let's see the conversation. Hello, this is my friend Carla. Hi, nice to meet you, Carla. This is my friend, Francisco. Francisco, do you know Edward? Yes, that's my friend too, okay? So here we have A, B, and Carla, right? C is Carla, okay? Now let's see. Let's see here. Um, do you have any question about this conversation? Este es uno de los usos de los pronombres demostrativos, ¿ok? Cuando nosotros presentamos a una tercera persona, ¿verdad? O a otra persona más, o hablamos de una persona que no está presente, podemos utilizar estos pronombres, ¿ok? Y este... Okay, thank you, Giovanni. So let's remember that in English, or let's notice that in English, in English, this is the correct way to introduce someone else. 
this is my friend or this is so and so this is my boss this is my cousin this is my mom okay because you have it right there okay now let's start everybody please read it with me please um open your mics and we are going to read uh, the conversation together okay Hello, this is my friend Carla. Hello, this Hello, is my, Hello, this is my friend Carla. Carla. Hi, nice to meet you, Carla. Hi, it's nice to, Hi, nice nice to meet, meet you, Carla. Carla. This is my friend Francisco. This, this is, is my friend, friend Francisco. Francisco. <clears throat> Francisco, do you know Edward? Francisco, do you know Edward? Yes, that's my friend too. Yes, yes, that's yes, my, my, my friend, friend too. too. Okay, this is Francisco, right? Letter C is Francisco, it's not Carla, it's Francisco. Okay, now, hello, this is my friend Carla. Hello, hello, hello. hello. This, hello. this is, is my, my friend, friend Carla. Carla. Hi, nice to meet you, Carla. Hi, Hi nice, nice to meet you, nice Carla. Meet you. Carla. This is my friend Francisco. This, this is my this friend, friend Francisco. Francisco. Francisca, do you know Edward? Francisco, do you know, you know Edward? Edward? Yes, that's my friend too. Yes, that's, yes. My, yes. Friend. that's my, my friend too. too. <clears throat> okay, now we are going to see an, uh, another conversation, okay? And this conversation is in plural. We are talking about them or they, okay? So we start reading like this. Do you see the three guys behind the window? Do you see the three guys behind the window? Yes, I do. Who are they? Yes, I do. Who are they? Uh, those are my associates in True Tapes Incorporated. Okay. Do you see the three guys behind the window? Yes, I do. Who are they? Uh, those are my associates in True Tapes Incorporated. Okay. This is letter A change it okay there we are i hope it doesn't change again i'm going to save it okay now i want to hear you guys i want to hear you please open your mic and we're going to read the conversation together do you see the three guys behind the window do you, do you see, you the, see three the three guys behind the, the window? Behind the window? Behind the window? Yes, I do. Who are they? Yes, yes I, I do. do. Who, are, Who are, they? are they? Where are they? Those are my associates in True Tapes Incorporated. Those, Those are, are my associates in True Tapes Incorporated. Okay, so now we are going to go to the breakout rooms and we are uh, practicing this, okay? One second. I will send you uh, the two conversations. Okay, I think there you have them. Okay, there we are. Doesn't change here. Okay, guys, I'm going to send you in groups of three, okay? Let 
because it's kind of slow tonight. Okay. El, um, el chat era lo que detenía lo demás. Okay, we are going by three. So, 12, four, five. There we are. ¿Qué es lo que vamos a hacer? Solo practicar las dos conversaciones. La idea es aprender cómo presentar a otra persona utilizando los, eh, uh, utilizando los pronombres demostrativos. Wendy, está bien. Usted puede utilizar, hacerlo por el chat con la persona que le toque. ¿Ok? ¿Ok? Bien. Uh, solo les voy a recordar a todos. Tenemos la situación de que a Wendy se le ha arruinado su audio. Entonces, eh, a quien le toque con ella, en este caso ya voy a ver quién le toque. Por favor, en el chat van a hacerlo, ¿ok? Eh, por, por solidaridad, ¿verdad, chicos? Vamos. Carlos, did Hello. you receive the invitation? Carlos Eduardo? Oh, se le... Edwin? Se le... Hello, teacher. You didn't receive the invitation? Uh, no. Didn't you? Okay, now let's see. Mm. Okay. Did you receive it already? Okay, there you are. Nos avisa cuando lo tenga. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Hello, this is my friend Carla. Hi. Nice to meet you, too, Carla. This is my friend Francisco. Francisco, do you know Edward? Carlos, su turno. Sorry por compartir pantalla, me quedé sin abrir. Ah, ok. Yeah, ok. Yeah, that is my friend too. Ok. okay. Eh, ah. Una pregunta, la siguiente imagen es, esas preguntas no, no las vamos a responder o después. It's a conversation and you have to practice it too, because that's uh, talking in plural, okay? Okay. Okay. Repeat. Uh, is... Eh, Juan Carlos, it's a conversation, not, not this uh, question. Okay. Okay. Uh -huh. One, one uh, classmate uh, asked ask a question to the other guy. Yes. 
es conversación con Carlos, no, es, no son preguntas y respuestas. Ah, perdón, perdón. Okay. Yes, I do. Who, where they? Do you see the three guys behind the window? Who is he? Linda? Eh, those are my associate, associates. B. B or A? A is, do you see the three guys behind the window? Yes, I do. Who are they? Ah, those are my associated in two days incorporated. Okay. 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 Uh, again. Okay, ahora soy B. 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 Okay, I start. Hello, this is my friend Carla. Hi, nice to meet you, Carla. This is my friend Francisco. Francisco, do you know Edward? Yes, that's my friend too. Hi, Carla. Aquí está todo complicado. Teacher, me funcionó el micrófono aquí. Okay, nice, nice. Well, for, for some reason, it wasn't working over there, right? Maybe when you go back to the main room, it's going to work. Like this, right? Let's cross our fingers. <laughs> uh -huh. Good luck. Okay, I want to hear you guys. Ok, estábamos ahorita debatiendo sobre cuál ¿Quién es va a decir qué? el orden. Ajá. Ok, pero bueno, si empiezo yo sería Hello, this is my friend Wendy. Right? Ya luego pues usted, Cari. Hi, nice to meet you, Wendy. This is my friend Carlos. Yeah, see Wendy. Okay, why don't you practice it as just as it is? Practiquenlo primero, just as it is, and then you can get the idea who is who, right? Then you are going to define who is present, I mean, introducing whom, right? So, and then you can practice with your own names if you want, okay? Okay, thank you. Bueno, entonces. Empezamos tal cual. Hello, this is my friend Carla. Hi, nice to meet you, Carla. This is my friend Francisco. Uh, Francisco, do you know Edward? Yes, that's my friend too. Ok, bueno, entonces ahora sí podemos cambiar, ¿no? <ríe> Pero, ¿saben? Pensándolo bien, es que teníamos la duda, teacher, sobre si Edward es un cuarto personaje. Yes, pero... it's a person that it is he's not in the conversation. He's not uh -huh. right there in the place. Okay, he's maybe he, I don't know where, but he's okay. out there, right? Okay, entonces vamos a inventar. Mm -hmm. <laughs> entonces, hello, this is my friend Wendy. Ahora sí. Uh -huh. um, hi, nice to meet you, Wendy. This is my friend Francisco. Es que yo creo que Wendy no habla, solo Francisco. O sea. Wendy is Francisco, right? Ajá. Ajá. Wendy will be Francisco. Entonces no sustituiríamos okay. el nombre Entonces, Carla, tiene Carla, sino que Francisco. Ajá. Yeah. Tiene Carla. Uh -huh. Entonces. Ajá. Entonces ahí en donde Francisco tiene que decir Carla. Uh, Wendy, perdón, do you know yes, instead of Francis, yeah, instead of Francisco is Wendy, right? Es que, es que como que los dos, lleva, los dos ustedes llevan un amigo. Yeah, es que but verdad, Carla doesn't speak. Carla no habla. Carla ah. doesn't speak. Yeah. Mm -hmm. entonces, entonces, digamos Carla, solo Francisco sustituyamos. Sí. Uh -huh. 
Okay. Uh -huh. okay yeah, no, instead of comentarlo. Francisco, let's say Wendy, yeah. right? Uh -huh. Ah, okay. <laughs> okay. Hi, nice to meet you, Carla. This is my friend, Wendy. Uh -huh. Entonces, aquí es... Aquí... <laughs> Wendy, do you know Edward? Aquí sí, otro cuarto. No, en este caso sería usted, yo creo que sería... Uh, Wendy, do you know Karina? No. No, no, no. Like this. Hello, he, let, let's try like this. Hello, okay. Carlos. This is my friend Wendy. Okay. Let's try like this. Okay. Karina. Let's try like this. Or Carlos, you may say, Hello, Karina. This is my friend Wendy. Okay. Hello, Karina. This is my friend Wendy. Uh -huh. Yo soy Andy. Okay. Yes, that's my friend too. Uh, no, because in that case, if it is Francisco, okay, if it is Francisco, uh -huh. es que, es que Carla y Edward no, 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 no I'm not, nada. I'm not visualizing the conversation. Can someone uh, show it? Are, are you seeing the conversation? Okay, <laughs> let me follow it. Let me follow it and I will help you. Uh, where it is, where it is, here it is. Okay. In that case, we'll be like this, right? Hello, this is my friend. Yeah, Carla. Yeah, Carla. And this case is hello, Carlos, right? This is my friend, Carla. Okay. And then, uh, hi, nice to meet you, Carla. This is then you say, uh, Carlos will say, um, this is my friend, Wendy, right? And then, Wendy, do you know Edward? Okay, because we are not going to change Edward because he's out there. Yes, that's my friend too. Okay, you got it. <laughs> Did you get it? <laughs> yes, I think. I think okay, yes. this is if you want to substitute. Okay, let's try. Let's try. This is nice. Okay. okay. Entonces, bueno, hello, Karina. This is my friend, uh, Carla. Hi. Hi, nice to meet you, Carla. This is my friend, Wendy. Yeah, there you are. Wendy, do you know Edward? Mm -hmm. Yes, that's my friend too. Okay. okay. There you are, you got it. Yay! Yeah, yeah, yeah. There you go, guys. You did a good job. Yes, nice. Nice. Now let's try in a different order. Maybe Pero, Wendy can start uh, the conversation now, right? Okay. Hello, this is my friend Karina. Es que siempre es Carla, solo en Francisco cambiamos. Yeah, Wendy, you've got to say, hello. yeah, only Francisco changes. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Hello, this is my friend Carla. Y supongo que aquí voy yo, ¿no? Porque pues, yes, para cambiar. Yes. Uh, <laughs> uh, hey, hi, nice to meet you, Carla. This is my friend. Y en este caso es Karina, right? Uh -huh. yeah. Karina, do you know Edward? No. Yes, that's my, my yes. friend too. Yay, we did it. Yes, yes, <laughs> there you are. Nice, continue practicing, guys, because you have to practice in the other conversation, the one in plural, okay? okay Try with you. the other one. The other one is easier, okay? okay? Now I'm going to another room. See you later. Okay. See you. Okay. Okay. Does does our college, college. my job? Yes. The job? Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. Uh, me. Yes, our college. So. Uh, me number A. Uh, B. Who? Who? Okay. Nancy. C. Uh, this. I'm sorry. Hello, everyone. How are you doing? Hello, Hello teacher. teacher. Okay, this letter C is letter A. Okay, this letter C is letter A. There, there are only uh, two people talking. Okay. Yeah. 
they are only two people talking and and this one yes and the last one yes we have a letter c speaking and that letter c is francisco okay and the first one and the ah, first tiene relación con... no 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 uh son dos independientes Ok, en esta pequeña es solo dos personas y estamos practicando el plural. Ok, ah, okay. y en la anterior, en la primera, estamos practicando el singular, solo una persona, ¿verdad? Esa ah, letra okay. C, el, el hablante C, es Francisco, ¿ok? Ok. En la conversación ven que hay un Francisco y le preguntan, Francisco, do you know Edward? Entonces Francisco responde, yes, that's my friend too. Okay. 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 Uh, Continue, una, guys. Okay. Okay. Yeah, una misma, es una misma. Es una misma conversación, entonces. No, no, una no. Continuación. No. no, no, they are different. Okay, esas son dos conversaciones independientes. Okay. Okay. Ok, entonces quizás nos podemos dividir, va, unos que digan la primera y otros la segunda. Correct, Ajá. good. Uh -huh. Ok. okay. Eh, lo, ya, ya no le dejaríamos así como teníamos aquí que le habíamos agregado un pedacito para que participáramos para los cuatro. Para decir los cuatro. Ajá. Oh, ok. Vemos Look, que... invent. Yeah, yeah, I understand. <laughs> Okay. Nice, nice. That's creativity. Good, good. <laughs> Go ahead. Okay. Continue. It's okay. 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 Hello. This is my friend Carla. Hi. Um, nice to meet you, Carla. Nice to meet you too. This is my friend Francisco. And this is my friend Suleima. Suleima. Uh, okay. Do you know? Do you know Alex? Yes, that's my friend too. Okay. Very uh, good. Do you see the three guys behind the window? Behind. Behind, I'm sorry, behind. Mm -hmm. Behind the window? Yes, I do. Who are they? They say yeah, that's uh, those. Those. those? Are my social tests associates associates in Trupais e in C? Si, no, incorporated. Incorporated. Yeah. Okay. Again. Uh, hello, this is my friend Carla. Hi, nice to meet you, Carla. Nice to meet you too. This is my friend Suleima. Suleima, do you know Alex? Yes, that's my friend too. Do you see the three guys behind the window? Behind. 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 Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. behind. behind. <laughs> okay. Do you see the three guys behind the window? Yes, I do. Who are they? Those are my associate in Trupe. Associate. Yo le veo la boca porque no. Associate. 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 Ok. In Trupe. True tapes. True Ajá, True Tapes es el nombre de la compañía, ¿verdad? True Tapes Incorporated. Incorporated, yes. Those are my colleagues in Joy. Oh, I'm sorry. Those <laughs> are my colleagues in Joy. Okay, again. Hello, this is my friend Carla. Hi, nice to meet you, Carla. Nice to meet you, too. This is my friend Suleima. Suleima, do you know Alex? Yes, that's my friend too. Do you see the three guys behind the window? Yes, I do. Who are they? 
Those are my associates in Trupeis Incorporated. So, so, teach. <laughs> Okay. Carla, over there you say, those are my colleagues too, podría decir. Those are my colleagues too. Those are my colleagues too. Mm -hmm. My colleagues, I say two. Are. Mm -hmm. Okay, are there colleagues. you are. Okay, continue guys. You are doing a very good job. Okay. Thank you, teacher. Okay. Thank you, teacher. Hello, this is my friend Carla. Hello, teacher. Teacher. Hello, how are you doing? Teacher. Uh huh. Tell me. Tell me. I have one question. Excuse me. I have one question. Tell me. What is your question? When we use the pronoun, the the adjective, this. Maybe I don't listen to you very well. One one second, let me see. Okay, say it again. Donde ocupamos el pronombre de this y that, y that. In the conversations that we are using, introducing sí, pero, people. Pero vaya, that viene siendo lo mismo, casi lo mismo que this, ¿verdad? Uh, and not exactly. Not exactly. Okay. This, okay. Sure. This is my friend Silvio. Okay. And that's my friend uh, Carlos. Okay. That's my mm -hmm. friend Carlos because he is far away from me, right? So, Near or far away? Yeah. Near is, Near is this. Okay. Mm -hmm. And in another proximity, then it's that. Okay. Maybe he is right there uh, to five or eight steps from me, right? So that's my friend. Right? Is it okay, Giovanni? For example, I have this cell phone. Yes. You can and, say that. Mm -hmm. Yes, correct. Um, Pero el uh, uso que estamos viendo ahorita, el uso que estamos viendo en estas conversaciones es cómo presentar a alguien más. ¿Ok? Cómo presentar a alguien. ¿Ya? Yeah? Usually we want to say, he is my friend, right? But that's not the way to say it. The correct way to say it is using the demonstrative uh, pronouns. We say, this is my friend, or this is fulano de tal, right? This is so-and-so. So-and-so significa eso, fulano de tal, okay? Pero siempre, pero siempre, siempre manteniéndose de si está cerca o, o no. Por ejemplo, this is, es, lo tengo aquí a la par o está como... Y porque allí lo veíamos en el, lo de Edward, es, Edward ni siquiera está... Edward is not there. Ajá, no, no está presente, entonces mm -hmm. por eso ella, eh, bueno, el último dice, yes, that's my friend, o sea, friend. no está cerca, uh -huh. es singular that, pero está lejos, por decirlo así. Yes, yes. Ah, ok. Mm -hmm. He's not in the group, right? Or near the group. He's maybe out there and somewhere else, right? Uh -huh. Yeah, he's buying churritos. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay, there you are. I want to hear you guys. Anadelmi, how are you doing? Hello, teacher. Hi. I want to hear you practicing the conversation. Um, ingresé tarde, por eso estoy perdida, pero ya más o menos me, me comentaron los... Los compañeros, ¿cómo más o menos vamos a hacer la conversación? Ok, eh, so you ready? Señor... Are you ready now? Hello, this is Fring Ana. 
Okay. Mm, hi, nice to, to meet you, Hannah. This is my friend, Silvio. Silvio, do you come, Edward? Yes, that's my friend too. Yes, as it is. Okay, do you know, right? Do you know? Mm -hmm. And what about the one in plural? The conversation using the plural demonstrative pronouns. La otra conversación? Um, ahí nos quedamos. <laughs> <laughs> I want to hear you guys. There are only two people talking in this conversation. Solo son dos personas hablando en esta conversación. Okay. Okay. See the, the three guys behind the windows? Yes, I do. Who are they? Those are my associate in the True Tapes Incorporate. Incorporated, right? Incorporated. Okay. My associate. 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 Thank you. It's a synonym of colleagues, right? Associates. Or maybe people who works with you in the same place, right? Mm -hmm. Associate. Yeah. Partners, right? Partners. Okay, guys. Are you ready then? Yes. yes. Okay, I, I, I think so, but let's see. I'm going to another room, so please continue practicing. Okay, okay. don't stop. Practice as much as you can. Okay. 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 Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> ya practice, no hablan, ya no, no, aquí está ella. <laughs> hey, Ram, how are you doing, guys? <laughs> ya no vamos, dice Ana. Uh, no, not yet, not yet. <laughs> okay. Hecho, we... el, mm -hmm. Hemos estado en el dilema. Ahí hay cinco personas, ¿verdad? Yes. Y dos yes. no están, digamos que ahorita serían dos. One is dos not present. No están presentes, que no hablan. Yeah, uh, no, 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 two because Carla and Edward, Ooh. right? Carla Ooh. doesn't speak and Edward doesn't speak because he's yeah. not there. Uh huh. Wait, Carla is God. there. Carla is there, but she doesn't speak. Edward is not present. Uh -huh. Ah, uh -huh. it's not Edward present. not present. Edward is absent over there. They're it's just talking sent. about, <laughs> yeah, absent. Uh -huh. <laughs> Uh, hey. the the one a hey. hey, letter a yeah <laughs> letter a hey. a friend a friend <laughs> hey. um, a a d l o yes cualquiera menos b y a is with Carla okay b is with Francisco okay like if they are two couples right or something like that uh huh okay, uh -huh. okay. entonces nosotros lo habíamos Este, practicado así como era. Empecemos. Para okay. Que, I want to see you. Okay. I want to hear you. Hello. This is my friend Carla. Nice. Hi. Nice. Nice to meet, to meet you, Carla. This is my friend Francisco. Francisco. Sí. 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 Do you know Edward? Yes. That's my friend too. Sería. Okay. Yes. Yo podría, yo sería Francisco en este caso. Francisco es el C, ¿verdad? Yes, Francisco uh -huh. is letter C. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Okay. Yes. Uh -huh. Y el otro es, do you see the three guys behind the window? Yeah, we don't say guys, we say guys, okay? okay. Guys. 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 Yeah, guys. because it's now it's another word. Uh -huh. Guys be behind? Behind, behind. Behind. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Do you see the three guys behind the window? Do you see the three yes. guys begin behind the window? Behind behind the window. The window? Mm -hmm. Do you see the three guys? Guys, 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 guys. Mm -hmm. okay, guys. Do, do you see the behind. three guys, guys behind the window? Do you see the guys behind the window? Behind, behind, behind. 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 
Behind the window. Detrás, detrás, detrás. Yes. Uh -huh. And the yes, back, right? Behind. Yes, I do. Who are they? Those that are, are my associates in the true tapes in. Okay, those are my associates. Associates. Yes, those say those, those are my associates in true tapes. Mm -hmm. Those are my those are those, my associates. Those are my associ associates. 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 Yes. Okay. Yes, we have to. Associates. Those are my associates. Associates and True Tapes Incorporated, right? Or we could say True Tapes Incorporated. Okay, guys. I think we are going back. We are going to the main room now, okay? Okay, thanks. Okay, my pleasure, guys. Pensamos que nos habían olvidado. Why is that? Don't think like that. Okay. I will never abandon you. Okay. I will never abandon you. <laughs> I will be always with you guys. Okay? Is, the, is the memory conversation? They repeat and repeat and repeat. <laughs> <laughs> okay, yes. Yeah, the thing is that I I went to each group today. Okay, I I sometimes I just choose one and and I see the other like um just checking. But no, today I went group by group. So I just finished with the group number five. So I'm sorry guys for the others that who had to wait for a little, but yes. When you go to the breakout rooms, the idea is that you practice as much as you can, okay? Because that's the only way to master. That's the only way to master any language, practicing, speaking, 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 and the same speaking of, uh, over and over again, okay? So feel happy for that. <laughs> Siéntanse felices porque practicaron el día de hoy, okay? Okay, guys, we are going to start now because we want to listen to Suleyma, okay? Suleyma and your classmates. We want to listen to you guys. Okay. Hello, this is my friend Carla. Hi, nice to meet you, Carla. Hi, Hi nice, nice to you meet you too. <laughs> nice to meet you too. This is nice to meet you too. Uh -huh. Suleyma, do you know Alex? Yes, that's my friend too. Okay, great, great. Now, uh, only one, it's okay. Now let's continue listening to uh, Juan Carlos, but I'm going to ask Juan Carlos something, okay? Juan Carlos, who's that behind you? Juan Carlos, who is that? The little girl, who's that? Uh, Who is that? Your, your daughter. Uh huh. ¿Cómo sería la respuesta de Juan Carlos? Vamos a ver. Bring her. Bring her. Can you help me, please? <laughs> okay. Everybody, please. Everybody, let's do this. I'm asking. Who is that, Juan Carlos? This is my lady girl. Okay, great. Do you see, Juan Carlos? This okay. is. 
my daughter, right? Or my baby girl. That's good. Yeah, that's a, a very caring name, right? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, but we don't see her. We don't see her. So uh, sometimes she appears over there. She shows up. Por eso, porque apareció por ahí. Okay, aproveché okay. para. Who's that? Okay. 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 There you are. Thank you very much. Now, Juan Carlos, start your conversation with your, with your classmates. Okay. Eh. Carlos. Linda. Okay. Ah, Linda. Hello, this is my friend Carla. Hi, nice to meet you too, Carla. This is my friend Francisco. Francisco, do you know Edward? Yes, that is my friend too. Okay, great. Thank you very much, guys. Now let's listen to Silvio. Wani and Kevin and Anna. Okay. Come on, guys. Ready? Yes. Hola. Yes, Ana Delmi. Do you see the behind the window? La segunda conversación. Okay. Yes, I do. Who are they? Entonces, are associate in through tables incorporation. Okay, incorporated. Okay. Incorporated. Uh huh. Okay, guys. Uh huh. Se aprovecharon. You took advantage for the second, right? <laughs> nice. Nice try. Nice try. You did a good job. You did a good job. Okay, let's listen to Annie. Con Christy y. Ay, Eliseo, creo. Edwin. Edwin. Sí, pero ella me liceo. Sí, yeah, yes. his middle yes. name is Eliseo. His middle name mm -hmm. is Eliseo. Yeah. Yeah. Cristina. Oh. Sí, sí, tú. Okay. Hello, this is my friend Carla. Hi, nice to meet you, Carla. This is me, my friend Francisco. Francisco, do you know Edward? Yes, that's my friend too. <laughs> okay, okay, yeah. Okay, okay, yeah. I was I was thinking about uh that the little girl uh shows up, I mean showed up again. So I was gonna see who was there. But yeah, you did a good job too. Uh remember that we are talking uh you count like five people in that conversation, right? Like five people in that conversation. Maybe A is Carlos friend. B is Francisco's friend, yeah? And Francisco speaks, uh, but Edward is not there, right? Edward, so they are five people in the conversation. You got it? You got it? So now we are going to do a little uh, twist here, okay? We're gonna give a little twist. So I'm going to say, hello guys, all of you, right? All of you, this is my friend, Kevin. Did you know my friend Kevin? Everybody yes. say, hello, Kevin. Nice to meet you, Kevin. Everyone. Hello. Hello, hello Kevin. Kevin. Nice to meet you. Okay. Now, Kevin, nice to meet you too, guys. Nice to meet you too. Nice to meet you too, guys. Okay, there you are. You see, this is how to introduce a third person using they demonstrative uh, pronouns, this and that, okay? This and that, or these, if I say Juan, uh, Juan Carlos, Kevin, and Annie, right? I'm going to present, these are my friends, Juan Carlos, Kevin, and Annie, okay? I say these, these are my friends, these are my friends in plural, right? These are my friends, Juan Carlos, Kevin, and Annie. Okay, and we can continue the conversation, but I introduced three people. So I have to use these, these. If I only talk about one person, I could say, this is my friend Giovanni Ramirez, okay? Or I could say only one person, this is my friend Linda, okay? 
one person. Esa es la forma de presentar a una tercera persona, ¿ok? Teacher. A alguien. Uh -huh. This is cerca, that is lejos, o, o, o cómo estaría en este caso cuando, porque estamos en el mismo classmate, el mismo, eh, ¿cómo se llama? En la misma clase es un this. Yes, yes. Because I'm, uh, we are like um, in a meeting here, right? We are together, we are near, we have a proximity over here. I could say these, right? This, because we are in the same place or in the same um, activity, right? We are the same group, right? So these, yeah? They are like in a proximity. But if I say, for example, uh, that is my boss. For example, let's say, uh, do you know Mr. Morales? Do you know Mr. Morales? And you say, no, that's my boss. Okay, that's my boss. He's not here. Then I can use that because he's not there, right? Correct. Thank you. Entonces no, no es solo uh, proximidad como así física o algo así. Uh, not exactly because here we are in a proximity uh, simulating in a physical but it's virtual this is new this is new okay uh, yeah we use this we use this because we are together right we are together we are present here so we have a proximity but it has to be near it has to be near when we say this okay Correct. Okay, let's go and we're going to um, let's go to um, do an exercise. This is just to understand uh, better. Okay, to understand better. Let me go there. Just let me see if I have it open here because I did something that I didn't have to do. Okay, there we are. Okay, guys, I'm going to share this exercise. In this exercise, you are going to read and you are going to match the images with the sentences, okay? Let's see. Okay. Here we have some sentences. Let's read the sentences first. Uh, the activity is too much with these images. Okay, number one, our company is going to buy this building. We are showing the building, okay? Our company is going to buy this building, this building. Number two, this isn't a good quality product. This isn't a good quality product. Maybe I have it right here, right? This isn't a good quality product. It broke, okay? It broke, okay? It broke. Now, number three, these markers are better than those you usually buy. These markers are better than those that you usually buy, okay? If I say, oh, here like this, these markers, okay? These markers are better than those you usually buy, than, let's see, those you usually buy, okay? Do you have a marker over there? Uh-huh, Wendy, let's try. Maybe your audio is working. La lista. Oh, yes. thank you very much. Thank you, thank you. I'm gonna stop doing this because it's very important to take the attendance, okay? Thank you very much, Wendy. Now, Ana Cristina Chavarria Flores. Ana del Carmen Mejia Alvarez. Present teacher. Present teacher. Ana del Mi Herrera Morales. Present teacher. Carlos Alberto Meléndez Rosales. Carlos Eduardo Maldonado Vázquez. Present. Carlos Roberto García Ramírez. Present. Daniel Enrique Orellana Mejía. Edwin Eliseo Orellana Vivas. Present. Okay. 
Um, Giovanni Alexander Pineda Romero. Present teacher. Giovanni Alexander Ramírez Sánchez. Present teacher. Juan Carlos Palacios Ramírez. Present teacher. Ok. Karina Noemí Álvarez Mejía. Present. Ok. Uh, Carla Verónica Suria López. Present, teacher. Kevin Antonio Ramírez Sánchez. Present. Linda Stephanie Ramírez Abrego. Present, teacher. Nancy Beto Bar Rivera. Present, teacher. Silvio Enrique Cortés Flores. Present, teacher. Zuleima Verónica Melgar Díaz. Present, teacher. Wendy Xiomara Núñez. Present, teacher. There we are. Thank you very much, guys. Okay. Let's continue here reading the, the, um, the sentences and trying to get, okay, the illustration that correspond to every, to each sentence. So let's see, this is a very good movie, okay? This is a very good movie. She needs to buy a new dress for that elegant event. She needs to buy a new dress for that elegant event, okay? That elegant event. Okay, now, sometimes these pronouns substitute, okay? But sometimes they uh, help to explain, okay? Um, the, the subject or the proximity, right? Of that thing, right? So for example here, our company is going to buy this building, okay? It's explaining or specifying, not that building, this one, okay? Not that, but this one. Okay, let's read it again. Our company is going to buy this building. Now, I want to hear you guys. Uh, Wendy, please read number one. Our company is going to buy this building. 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 Okay, Linda, number two. This isn't a good quality product. Okay, uh, let's see. Ana Delmi, number three. Is um el three? Yes, please. They they see marker markers are it B3 better yes. better better than chosen your usuality ball. Bye. Bye. Okay. <laughs> No, bye bye. <laughs> yeah, but you usually okay. buy, okay? Or purchase. So buy. Okay. <laughs> there you are. Okay. Thank you very much, Ana Delmi. Okay, let's see number four. Giovanni Ramirez, please. With intonation. This is, this is a very good movie. Okay, great. Do you see? Lo hizo con mucha emoción, ¿verdad? This is a very good movie. ¿Se fijan que hay un signo de admiración? Hay que ponerle ese, ese toquecito, ¿verdad? This is a very good movie, okay? It's a very good movie, okay? Let's try. Sure. Okay, go ahead, please. She needs the, to buy a new dress for that elegant events okay good elegant event there you are okay guys what are we going to do now match the sentence with the corresponding image por favor entren y con la opción de anotación ahí pueden usar una o dibujar línea esa es la opción draw a line and you use the one like this okay did you find it? There you are. Thank you. There you are, Wendy. 
Good, Nancy. Okay. Okay, Linda. Okay, Sulem. Mm -hmm. Good, Juan Carlos. There we are. Thank you, Edwin. Okay. Aha. Uh -huh. uh -huh. <laughs> y Edwin le puso un color bien fuerte y le puso también así como la línea más gruesa, right? <laughs> to be noticed. Okay, there you are. Good, Silvio. Excellent. Uh, let's see, Wendy, what did you... Okay, good, Wendy. Well done, guys. Good, Wendy. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. Excellent, Linda. Okay. So now we are going to stop. Okay, we are gonna stop. And uh, let me erase all the wiggles here. There we are. Okay, let's ask Nancy, please. Could you please match number one with the sentence with the image? Repeat, teacher. <laughs> you, okay, please match the sentence with the image, number one. Sentence number one. Okay. okay. Okay, thank you very much. Now, Linda, number two. Okay, thank you. Number three, please, Annie. Permítame, teacher, permítame. Ahorita. Okay, okay. Que este lapicito a mí se me traba. Okay. Okay, great. Now, number four, uh, Carlos Eduardo, please. This is a very good movie. Okay, great. Number five, Suleyma, please. Number five. There you are. Okay, now this is the way, okay, to match the sentence with the corresponding image. Do you have any question about the vocabulary in these sentences? Or is it clear how to use these and that and those and these? Is it clear? Yes. Yes, teacher. Okay, clear like horchata or clear like water? Horchata uh -huh. tamarindo. <laughs> I like tamarindo, oh my God. Like carao, right? <laughs> nice. Okay, when are we going to use these and that? Uh, 
¿Cuándo los vamos a utilizar? These and that. Do you see? When they are near and they are only one thing. Okay? Near and one thing. When are we going to use these and those? Plural. Yes, when we are talking about uh, a uh, subject in plural, okay? And the things are not near, the things are far, okay? From, far from the person who's talking, okay? Está lejos de la persona quien está expresando la idea, okay? Ahora, vamos a ver entonces, ahorita, eh, Oh, quiero ver, creo que no la tengo acá. Permítanme. O oh, cómo no. Mm, uh, luego vamos a tener esa conversacioncita, ¿ok? En la última conversacioncita que vamos a hacer, uh, vamos a anotar que a veces, a veces, eh, pues se usa de una forma diferente. Pero esta es la forma correcta, ¿ok? La forma correcta y la forma base de aprender this and that and this and those. Ok. Now, let's go to our manuals. Ok. In our manuals, we have... Ahí vamos a notar también... Por eso decimos de la persona que está hablando. De eso depende, de la persona que está hablando. De eso depende qué es lo que va a usar. This or that. Okay? Uh, de la proximidad de las cosas a la persona que está hablando. Okay? Vamos a ver. Le, déjenme compartirles el manual. We are in page, uh, I think, 21, right? 20. Page 20. Page 20. This is to complete the content of these, I mean, the demonstrative uh, pronouns. Let me go there. I'm going to share it. There we go. Okay, and here we can see when we are talking about singular, uh, something in singular and something in plural, then we have different pronouns to use. Okay, I want to buy this computer. Do you see? I want to buy this computer. We checked this cell phone on the web page. We checked this cell phone on the web page. She is going to order that kit for her friend. She is going to order that kit for her friend. The company wants to buy that lift, okay? These things are far from the person who is talking and the two above are uh, near the person who's talking, okay? Now let's see the plural ones. You have to buy these shoes. He can pay with any of these credit cards. They purchased, I'm sorry, they purchased those cars. My coworkers sold those products. Now, I want you to read these sentences, okay? Let's see, Giovanni. Giovanni, please read the examples for the singular use, okay? For the singular pronouns. Pineda. Uh, I'm sorry, uh, Ramirez, please, because he, he was trying to get it better, okay? I'm sorry, uh, Mr. Pineda. I want to buy this computer. Okay, the next one. We check the cell phone on the white page. Okay, next one. She is going to order that kit for, the fr for her friend. Okay, and yeah, then? Yeah. The company wants to buy that lift. Thank you very much. Now, please, uh, Mr. Pineda, can you read the plural ones? Okay. 
you have to buy these shoes. Okay. He can, he can pay with any of these credit cards. They purchase those cars. My co-workers sold those products. Okay, thank you very much. Let's remember the intonation here are, aren't questions, okay? La entonación de estas, pre, de estas ejemplos no es de preguntas, sino que es de una eh, afirmación, right? O una negación si estamos utilizando los negativos, pero es como una oración, okay? So we have to aterrizar, ¿verdad? No subirlo al final. Por ejemplo, you have to buy these shoes. Shoes, okay? Down. Shoes at the end. No vamos a decir, you have to buy these shoes, okay? Porque entonces es una pregunta. Okay, guys? Now, do you have any question about the examples here? Questions about the examples? No, no, no question. Okay, people, let's look at these exercises. It says, write the correct demonstrative pronoun. Okay, it doesn't stop. Number one, these are like uh, small conversations, small conversations. So we are going to uh, read and let's think the answer. Uh, for the subject they are talking about, if it is plural or if it is um, singular. singular. There you go. So, number one. Mm -hmm. Do you want to buy a tablet? Mm -hmm. This tablet. This or that? This tablet. Do you want to buy this tablet? This tablet. This. That, that, that. Ajá, ahora, veamos entonces por qué decimos que depende de la proximidad del objeto a la persona que está hablando. Ok. Thank you, Wendy. Uh, does anybody disagree with this? Or is everybody okay with this answer? What do you think? Is it okay this? Yes, right? Yes. Okay, yes. Yes, it is okay. But uh, alguien dijo that, ¿verdad? Alguien de ustedes dijo que, que la respuesta era that. También podría utilizarse that, ok, si realmente la tablet está, por ejemplo, en un aparador, ¿verdad? Right? Or something like that. Ok. Do you want to buy this tablet? Yes, I want to buy the black one. Number two. Yes. Those. 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 Okay. Plural. Yes. Okay, who wants to write it down? Who wants to type it in? ¿Quién quiere escribirlo? Who wants to type it in? Ajá. Uh -huh. There you are. Thank you very much. Those. Now, number three. What do you think in number three? No, right, Kevin? Uh-huh. Kevin, what do you think? My friend. Did, did, uh -huh. did you bring? No, no, number three, number three. Ah, uh, number three. Uh-huh. Is it okay, this answer? Yes. 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 Yes.
Uh, uh, this. Uh huh. Like this, right? Let's see. This. Oops, I cannot select it. A ver, ¿qué piensan ustedes? That. Okay. Uh -huh. That. Okay, why that? Because makeup is like not countable, right? Non countable. Get in here. We could say that because of the question uh, from the buyer or the seller, right? It says the small box. Okay, my friend and I are interested on in that makeup. Yeah, that's correct. Number four. What do you think? Did you bring package? Yes, I did. Uh-huh. This or that? Yes. That. Why this and why that? A ver, ¿por qué this y por qué that? What do you think? Did you bring this package? Did you bring that package? Which that one is correct? Package. That. That package? That package is a counter. Excuse me? For, better, For me, bring. this. 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 <laughs> yeah, you're right. Okay. Money for money. Come on. <laughs> okay. Well, is that? Is that? That. That. Why, and Edwin? Do why do bring, you say that? Do you bring that pad? Es como aquel paquete. Yes, of course. That that's the meaning. Okay, that's the meaning. So here it depends. It depends on the proximity of the object uh, from the person who's talking, right? We could say that here we could say this or that. This or that is correct, but never plural because package is singular, okay? So we could, I'm sorry, let me. Oh, good. Here. This or that are correct. Both are correct, okay? We could say, did you bring this package? Or did you bring that package? Correct? Puede ser cualquiera de los dos. Y depende de la eh, cercanía o lejanía del paquete, ¿verdad? Okay. Number five. You can't add four sweaters to the charge. Is it plural or is it singular? Plural. 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 You're talking about four yes. sweaters. Yes. Mm -hmm. yes. Those. Yes. Yes. Uh huh. Those you can add it, those for this word is square. Okay, it's the same thing as the number one, right? Is it? It is the same thing as the number one, but usually, um, cuando. Estamos cerca o estamos lejos de las cosas. Hey, y vas a llevar esos cuatro suéteres. Right? Some, mm, something similar in our culture, right? We say those for sweaters to the chart, right? You can't add those for sweaters to the chart. 
What do you think? These or those? I think Wendy, right, was here. A ver, necesito ayuda, chicos, que me digan. These or those? Is it okay, this? Yes. Yes, yes teacher. Yes. No, teacher. Right? <laughs> Hi, chicos, chicos. This is correct. This is correct. Okay, number six. This. Thank you. Number six. What do you think? I have Those. to go to buy no. mm -hmm, new it's books. Plural. Those. Yes, it's plural. Correct. Those. So? Those. 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 Okay. Yeah, because you are not at the library yet. So, those, right? Good, thank you. Uh, there is uh, something here, okay? And, and I want you to notice. Library is the, the place where you go to do an investigation and you read books, right? But the correct word or the correct noun for the place where you buy books is bookstore, okay? Bookstore. Usually at the library, you don't buy the books. You just uh, do your investigations, right? At the library. But the correct word for the place where you buy books is bookstore, okay? Okay. Yeah, library is una biblioteca and bookstore is una libreria. Teacher, uh, the vocabulary charts. What do I mean? This? Sí, yes. Chart is el carrito de compras or la carreta de compras. Oh, thank you. Okay. Okay, people, the, um, the class for today is how to use can and could, okay? How to use can and could. I'm going to stop sharing here and I want you to, to see, um, <clears throat> I'm sorry. I want you to see how to use, I'm gonna stop this. Let's open this. I want you to see the uses. Okay, the uses of can and could. This is our uh, topic for tonight. Okay, how to use can and could. This is our topic. We are in the video conference number seven. And we are going to learn how to ask questions, okay? How to ask and answer questions using can and could. And you are going to do it in pairs. And this is for you to learn some formal language, okay? Some formal language. Our agenda at the moment, okay, we did our feedback, then we um, read the class objective, and we did some written activities. But now we are going to have a short briefing about can and could, then we are going to do some written activities too. And we are trying to request information politely in a conversation, okay? So now let me go to uh, show you. Okay, the three uses. These are three uses for can and could. And these are two modal verbs that we use when we want to ask or request in a very polite way, okay? In a very polite way. Even though can is not so polite, could it is, okay? And the levels, let's remember can, is polite, but could is more polite, okay? Can is polite, 
but could is more polite. Okay, let's see the questions we have in this presentation. Can I have your name? Okay, can I have your name? We are requesting or asking for information, right? Could you spell that for me, please? We are requesting in a polite way, okay? Can I have your phone number? Asking for information, okay? Could you tell me your address? What are we requesting there? We are asking for information. Can I take a message? Can I take a message? Ah, this is a polite offering, okay? A polite offering. Podemos ofrecerle a alguien de una manera muy amablemente hacer algo por esa persona, ¿ok? Entonces, por ejemplo, can I take a message is polite offering, ¿ok? Could you take a message? Could you take a message? Entonces estamos requesting. Nosotros le decimos a la persona, mire, hágame el favor, ¿verdad? Or something like that. Could you take a message? Requesting politely. Now, can I ask you what the delivery date is? Can I ask you what the delivery date is? We are asking for information, okay? You got it? Vamos bien hasta acá? Is it okay so far? A ver, así teóricamente. What are the uses of can and could? What are the uses of can and could? What do we use them? Polite. Could is very polite. Okay, great. Great. We use them in a polite language, right? In a polite and a very formal language. Correct? But what are the three uses that we are seeing here? ¿Cuáles son los tres usos que hemos visto acá? ¿Para qué los usamos? Es que... For question... For, for little offering. Correct, correct. These are the three uses. Asking for information, requesting politely, and polite offering, okay? Those are the three uses. Y como lo usamos en preguntas, okay? We ask questions. A ver, como respondemos esta pregunta? Can I have your name? Can I have your name? My name is. Yeah. Yes, My name is Carlos. Excellent. Oh, yes, my name is. Uh huh. Correct. Um. Pero cuando alguien me lo está solicitando así, can I have your name? Oh, sure, my name is, okay. Yo le digo, sí, claro, ¿verdad? Sure, my name is, okay. Y utilizamos esta palabra, please, porque es la palabra mágica, the magic word, para la cortesía, ¿verdad? Para la cortesía. Entonces, ¿cómo lo decimos? Can I have your name, please? Okay. Can I have your name, please? Can I have your number, your phone number, please? Can I have your phone number, please? Okay. For example, if I ask, um, let's see, I'm going to ask a question. Carlos Roberto. Carlos Roberto. Hello, teacher. Okay, can I have your email address, please? Mm, yes, you can. Okay, can I have it? 
Ah, ok, saludos. Es, <ríe> uh, GR. Uh -huh. Are you ready? Yes, go ahead. GR um, 16. Uh -huh. uh, 64. Uh, ¿Cómo se dice? Arroba, teacher, ¿me ayuda? At. At, ok. At UAS. That. Uh, e. D U that S V. Okay, and if you are just reading it, hello. Y si solo lo está leyendo sin sin um, sin spelling, sin deletrearlo, cómo lo diría? Okay, este debería debo decirlas es que como son siglas, ¿no? No, oh, okay, okay. No lo creo en español, pero. Okay. <ríe> Son todas siglas. Son mis iniciales, de hecho. G -R oh. My last name. Okay. Let's try to write it down over here. Is it okay if I write it down here? ¿Está bien si la escribo aquí para todos? Sí, sí. Okay. Can I have it, please? Can I have your uh, email address? Yes, you can. It's G R. 16. Okay, are they capital letters or are they uh, lower cases? Lower cases. Okay. G R. 16. Uh huh. 0 51. Okay. At, right? Mm -hmm. Oops. Sorry. Have something here. Uh, at. Mm -hmm. U. E. I. S. U. E. S. Mm -hmm. <laughs> that. E. D. U. Oh, Edu, right? Mm -hmm. yes. Dot com. Dot com? Isn't that SB? No, it's, it's, it's not com. It's com. Okay. <laughs> it is not com. Okay. So thank you very much. If you see, I could say, uh, can I have your email address? La respuesta no sería, yes, you can. It's better if you say, sure, or no problem. It is this and this and that. Okay. Mucho muy fuerte o algo así. Si yo digo, sí, bueno, no sé. Uh, yes, you can. Um, yes, it's like uh, if you are giving a permission. Here we are not asking for permission. We are just asking for information. Okay. okay? Mm -hmm. Si yo le pidiera como un permiso, entonces usted sí me puede decir, ah, claro que sí, puede. Right? Por ejemplo, si yo le pregunto, le pido permiso para levantarme o algo así, creo que sí, bueno, tiene más sentido. En ese caso sí, pero depende del contexto. Okay. okay, it depends on the context. Okay. Uh -huh. Y usualmente cuando yo pido permiso es mejor el permiso con may. Okay. Ah, so may I go to the bathroom, for example. Yes, may I go to the restroom. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> okay, you. guys. Thank you very much, Carlos Roberto. Now, guys, what are we going to do? You think, okay, about an answer for these questions. Okay. Ustedes tienen que pensar una respuesta para estas preguntas. Okay? For example, if I say, can I take a message? Una respuesta puede ser, oh, oh yes, please. Okay? Yes, please. Correcto? Or, could you take a message? Sure, no problem. Okay? Pero, para las demás, vamos a pensar una respuesta de acuerdo a su propia información, ¿correcto? Entonces, utilizamos can and could, asking for information, requesting politely, and doing polite offerings, ¿ok? Entonces, estas preguntas que tenemos acá, nos vamos a ir a hacer una pequeña conversacioncita, solo decir las preguntas y la otra persona responde, ¿ok? Y van a agregar dos preguntas más, ¿ok? Van a agregar dos preguntas más acerca de información 
Okay, asking for information. Cosas que ustedes quieran saber de su compañero. Okay, so let's do this in the breakout rooms. Only five minutes because this is, uh, es como un repaso, ¿verdad? Esto ya lo vimos antes y ahora lo vamos a practicar. ¿Correcto? ¿Hay alguna pregunta? Is there any question? No, teacher. Okay. Thank you very much, Lynn. So now we go. I initiate the things and I will send you the question. Hello. Hello, teacher. Hello, how are you doing? I'm waiting for Giovanni Alexander. Mr. Ramirez, are you there? He's there. <laughs> uh huh. Right. Maybe he's busy in. <laughs> in his private office, right? <laughs> okay, teacher, the, the, tell me. What is the exercise? Excuse me? What, what is the, the exercise? Exercise. What is the exercise? You have to practice these, <laughs> these questions. You. Uh, ask the question to your classmate and your classmate gives an answer for each. Uh, answer. Okay. okay, like a little conversation, right? But just practicing these questions. Y tienen que agregar dos más eh, pidiendo información okay, a su compañero de lo que quieran saber de su compañero. Okay? Uh, could, you, could you spell that mm -hmm. for me, please? Mm -hmm. deletrear? Yes. Uh -huh. For example, if you ask, can I have your name? Uh, my name is Edwin, right? Then you say, could you spell Edwin for me, please? Okay. Right? Okay. Something like that. Okay. Hey, welcome, it. Giovanni. Yeah. Welcome. Okay, well, start, welcome. guys. <laughs> I'm going to another group, okay? Thank you, Thank you. Thanks, Sí, ya lo habíamos visto, pero y no sé. De ahí sería. Ajá, usted me pregunta mi nombre, digamos. Ajá, I can have your name. Um... Sure. Remember, it's a question, okay? And in a question, we say, can I have your name? Okay. I can I? Yes. Can sure. I have your name? Sure, my name is Karina. Would you speak that for me, please? Uh, of course, K, it is K-A-R-I-N-A. -A. Mm. Nice to meet you, Secure. Karina. <laughs> <laughs> um, can I have Ready? your, uh -huh. can I have your phone number? Uh, sure. Six, two, 
night want to night to night para que me dieran ese fácil de allí cuyo teacher uh, what is can I take a message can I take a message uh, means for example the person that you are uh, are calling is not there okay it's not in the office or it's not in the place where you are calling uh, or he's okay. not available okay then the other person say can I take a message for so and so okay okay thank you uh -huh. Entonces... Tenemos que hacer todas esas preguntas. Not necessarily, but um, the thing is that you have to practice, okay? It's not necessary because you have like an order. I mean, you are taking the order of a conversation. So if you are just practicing the, the, the questions, I think you could say an, any answer, right? Oh, sure. Tell him that, call me back, right? If you're just practicing the um, questions independently, okay? Mm -hmm. But no, it's okay if you don't use it. Okay. Um, okay. Entonces, mm. sure. I, I can ask you, does delivery that is? Mm, es que no sé si contar eso porque no tiene nada que ver con lo que estamos hablando. Ah, o sea, okay. porque ajá, o sea, yo, yo digo de que aquí nos estamos como conociendo o algo así. Digamos que somos compañeras ah. de trabajo. Entonces no sabemos cómo nos llamamos y por eso le pedí mi número y así. Ah, ok. Es un número, ajá. Entonces no sé, podríamos hacer otra pregunta. Um, ah, lo de, lo de. Oh. Yo, yo email email address sí ajá ajá yo le pregunto entonces could you tell me your email address yes um, ahí lo digo de una vez teacher it is it is it is mm -hmm. Suleima Melgar, uh -huh. eh, la roba como era, at, at, plan, guión medio, ¿cómo es? Um, uh, <laughs> bueno, da, dash, punto. dash, 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 uh -huh. dash, international, eh, Punto that, no sé. that, 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 or or uh -huh. okay. um, yeah. <laughs> um, um preguntar los años muy muy abusivo tan temprano <laughs> sí <laughs> yeah and talking about the ages you don't use can i or can you tell me right you, you just say how old are you right you just say that, mm -hmm. and it's not polite, I think. No. Carina no le da pena, pero nosotras ya no cumplimos. Bueno, usted está joven todavía. No, no, we're not, we're not, we're the same. Okay, uh -huh. Carina hasta lo va a gritar ahí sin pena. 18, uh -huh. sin 20. Uh -huh. Ay, 18, 15. Ay. So you can say okay. that, Zulema. You uh -huh. can say, well, I'm 22. 22. <laughs> okay, 22. Uh -huh. okay. Um, okay. 
podemos decir para despedirnos. Um, can we talk okay, later? Okay, I'm going to another room. Okay, continue. Okay. Bye. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> Was it nice to practice how to ask for information and how to request politely? Okay. Now let's listen to let uh well in this case let's see let's listen to Linda please with your classmates. Okay, with Kevin. Um, can I have your name, please? Yes, yeah, sure. Kevin Ramirez. Could you spell that for me, please? Um, of course. Um, K, K E B I M. Okay, can I have your phone number? Uh, sure, my number is 7631-6673. Okay, could you tell me your address? Uh, no problem, my address is Avenue Roosevelt. Okay, can I take a message? Yes, you can. Could you take a message? No problem. Yes, I can. Can I ask you what the delivery day is? Uh, on Thursday, 31. 31st. 31st. Okay. Yes, remember 31st. ordinal numbers. No. Yes. Okay, guys, well, they practiced all the, the questions independently, okay? So they did a good job. So now let's listen to Suleyma, please, with your classmate. Okay, teacher. Good evening, can I have your name? Sure, my name is Suleyma. Sorry, could you spell that for me, please? S U L E A M eight. Nice to meet you, Suleyma. And you have your name. Sure, my name is Karina. Could you speak that for me, please? Of, of course, is K A R I M A. Nice to meet you, Karina. Can I have your phone number? No problem. Seven, eight, two, 
want to night to night. Could you tell me your email address? Suleima Melgar does plant um, international or can we talk later? I have to go. Yes, but of course. Okay. Okay, you did a conversation and that's good. Thank that you, Karina. Very good. Okay, now who wants to participate? Only one more couple. Only one more couple. Who wants to participate? Oh, uh -huh. I know who wants to participate. Nancy wants to participate, right? <laughs> okay. There you are with um, your class. Giovanni. Okay. Um, can I have your name? And Giovanni? Yes. Okay. Sure. My name is Giovanni. Will you, will you spell that for me, please? No problem. It's G-E-V-O, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. G-E-O-V-A-N-Y. Can I have your phone number, please? Right away. My number, cell phone is 7777-00-00. Okay. Could you tell me your address? Okay, my address is Avenue Mascota, Block 7, San Salvador. Thank you. Could you, take, could you take a message, message, please? Okay, in a minute. In a minute, okay. In a minute, in a minute, okay. okay. Can I ask? you watch the delivery that is please sure it is september that september the 20 of 2021 okay okay, okay. Um, could you come for a moment mm, yes Hey, can you other diner? Sure. Okay. Okay, nice. Now, guys, today, um, well, today I think we finished and it is 10 o'clock already. So I have to take the attendance. Just let me go there. I'm checking also that the session one-on-one -on -one was for Daniel Enrique and he's not, um, he didn't attend tonight. So we have this space available. Who wants the space? Is there anyone interested in staying to, to ask any question? Do you want to have your session one on one tonight? Uh huh. Okay. Let's see. <sighs> okay, guys. Okay. Thank you, Carlos Eduardo. There we are. I'm going to take the attendance and then we dismiss, okay? Ana Cristina Chavarria Flores. Ana, okay, Ana del Carmen Mejía Álvarez. Present teacher. Ana del Herrera Morales. Present teacher. Carlos Alberto Meléndez Rosales. Carlos uh, Eduardo Maldonado Vázquez. Present. Okay. Carlos Roberto García Ramírez. Daniel Enrique Orellana Mejía. Edwin Eliseo Orellana Vivas. Present teacher. 
Giovanni Alexander Ramirez Sanchez. Juan Present Carlos teacher. Palacios Ramirez. Thank you very much. Present teacher. Um, Karina Noemi Álvarez Mejía. Present. Carla Verónica Suria López. Present. Kevin Antonio Ramírez Sánchez. Present. Linda Stephanie Ramírez Abrego. Present teacher. Nancy Beto Rivera. Present teacher. Silvio Enrique Cortés Flores. Present teacher. Zuleima Verónica Melgar Díaz. Present teacher. Wendy Xiomara Núñez. Present. Okay, there we go, guys. Me teacher, present. Mr. Pineda, okay, yes. Just give me one second, Giovanni. Uh, well, I take you in now. Okay, there we are. I'm sorry, Giovanni. Okay. Now, guys, uh, have a good night and let us meet on Monday. Please do your homework, okay? Do your homework. Good night, teacher. Have a good Teacher, weekend. Yes, tell me. Uh, no, the question. Tell me. Uh, uh, hasta qué tarea es? Perdón. Uh, we are in seven, I think, right? Seven. seven. Yes. Oh, okay. Oops. Homework seven. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Thank because you. Today Thank is the video conference number seven. There we are. Thank you. Have a good, good night. Good night. Bye. good night. Bye bye. Bye bye. See you Monday. Good night. Have a good bye -bye. night, teacher. Bye bye. Bye. bye, -bye. Good night. Okay, Carlos, here we are. How can I help you, Carlos? I can hear you. I can hear you. Your audio. Yeah. Sorry, sorry. Okay, no problem, no problem. I uh, have problem with the uh, uh, discussion uh, exercise. Okay, and tell me. I, I, I can't do it uh, anywhere. Uh, I have idea, but um, no. Uh, uh, About the questions or yeah. the questions using can and using could. Uh -huh, yeah. Okay. Oh, oh the, the 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 asking the to eat and um, drink water for a week. Mm, okay. All the questions sure. that we did in the exercise. Okay. Yes. Are those? Uh, how much do you eat and drink? Or uh, I guess. Oh, in the discussions. I'm sorry. Okay, now in, I get in it. Discussion. In yes. the discussions. Uh huh. Uh, okay. Yeah. Uh, I I listen to to uh, link. Okay. Um. I can do it. In, in Couldn't you do it? Uh, the problem here is that I cannot show the exercise. But this is a conversation between a man and I think his wife. Right. I, I know I'm not a diet, um, uh -huh. uh, but I regularly eat it. Uh -huh. uh, and, pero, eh, perdón, que hablo en español. Okay. Pero en, en el tema de discusión veo que dice usar las palabras. Eh, Have to. Es, Ajá, yes. Entonces, para ponerlas así, un ejemplo, teacher. For example, if you give like an um, instruction, okay, uh, saying, okay, I eat, right? I eat uh, yogurt or I have yogurt and fruit for okay. breakfast because the doctor say that I have okay. to, okay? Some things uh, explaining uh, like obligations or instructions. Remember the first topic that we were studying was have to do something and we think about the to-do list. For example, if you say, how much do you eat and drink in a week? Okay, a week. Uh -huh. it was in a week, right? So for example, you say, they say you have to uh, eat, vegetables 
to be healthy, right? So I eat vegetables every day, right? a, a portion, right? So uh, just sentences, simple sentences, uh, forming a paragraph, yeah? Forming a paragraph, explaining your opinion. Right. Yeah, um, explaining your opinion uh, yeah, I, about I, your I, own information. I don't have a diet. <laughs> you, you don't have a diet? <laughs> okay, a, a menu? I, I, I uh, love I love coffee more. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Uh, but uh, did you read? Did you read the discussion? I mean, the opinions that your classmates uh, wrote. Yes. Okay, take yes, the yes. idea. For example, I think Carlos Roberto was just saying that he drinks a lot of water because he has to. Okay. Uh, Things like this. Uh -huh. Things like this. Uh, y la, the, the other question. Uh huh. Uh, for possibility. And yes, asking for I can show that one. Okay, just let me go there. Okay, uh, yes, only only answer. Yes, Did only only answering. Uh huh. Ah, okay. 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 Here we have the discussion. Let me uh, Go there. Discussion. No, no, no much uh, classmate teacher. No, no participate. Is one yes, they did. Two. Yes, they told me that. Well, uh, just like I'm sorry, just like you, they say that they were going to work until Friday. Do you remember that? So they are going to do it on the weekend. That's what I'm waiting for, okay? I expect that you work on the weekends and this. But just let me go to the, to the discussion. Can for possibility and asking for information, okay? Okay. And Wait, um, I'm just, yes. yes, and I'm just asking for you to share an answer with us, uh, right? Here uh, in the platform. You... Get a good cup of coffee in San Salvador in okay. <laughs> uh, okay, that's uh, yeah, it's an opinion and it's kind of information, Multi right? Plaza. <laughs> Giving information. So, okay, where can you get a good cup of coffee in San Salvador, right? Then you tell where exactly and you say why if you want, okay? The, then... the answer, uh, the answer, the uh, complete answer is. Um, a good cup of coffee in San Salvador is a uh, Starbucks multiplaza. Okay, tendría que utilizar toda la información nuevamente, right? Okay. You get, you can get a, a good cup you of coffee in, and then you coffee. say the restaurant Starbucks name. In okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. okay. You can. Yes, yes. you coffee. you can get a good cup of coffee in and then you say the place. Okay. Because the question here is where it's a place. Where? Now, what about when we ask when? When okay. can people eat hojuelas in El Salvador? Oh, uh, it's in November. <laughs> uh-huh. November, uh, what date? When two. The second. Ah, it's <laughs> okay. Yes, ordinal it's numbers. Second. Yes, remember that you have to write the two and D. Okay. Yeah, the November, November seconds, the second. <laughs> oh, well, no, it, it's year. no year, no year because you do it every year, right? Oh, okay. It's traditional. Yes. Yeah. It's traditional. So the third question it says, who can lend you a hand in your workplace? Who can lend you a hand in your workplace? Then it's if we ask who. The answer is a person, right? Or maybe a colleague's, a colleague's uh, name. Lend you a hand is help. Yes, give you a hand. Mm -hmm. Okay, ah, okay. Yes. it's new for me. Okay. Ooh, can lend you a hand in your workplace. Ah, okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. If you have yeah. someone to uh, that helps you to do your job, uh, it's, for example. Uh, it's my colleague. Uh, for example, my yes. colleague. Okay. My, my colleague. colleague. Uh huh. Oscar. Colleague. Mm -hmm. Colleague. Uh -huh. My colleague, Oscar, is uh, 
it's a very nice people. <laughs> okay, a guy, a, 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 tipo sería guy. A guy, okay. it's a very nice guy. <laughs> yeah, it's a very nice guy. Guy, uh-huh. Or he's my buddy. My buddy is like michero, right? Oh, my buddy. My buddy, uh-huh. Okay. Yeah. And you spell that like B-U-D-D-Y. B-U-D-D-Y. Buddy. Buddy, así como la película de las carreteras. Buddy. Yeah, the buddies. Uh-huh. Yes. Okay. Uh -huh. okay. So who can in your hand in your workplace? So this three, and you just share an answer to those questions and post them here. Okay. Thank you, teacher. Mm -hmm. okay. okay, I'm waiting for everybody to work on the weekend about uh, on this <laughs> on this activity. Uh huh. Okay, and, uh -huh. and uh, today um, uh, um, tomorrow early. <laughs> yes, because remember that we were used to Fridays to finish everything, but well, the the thing is that we changed that because we didn't start on monday we started on wednesday right or on yeah. thursday mm -hmm. on thursday so thursday friday then you complete the week on wednesday so we have to change that to wednesday mm -hmm. okay it's and kind of more difficult uh, uh, excuse me that's all my my uh, problem with okay okay discussion uh right mm -hmm. discussion okay no problem uh that's what i'm here for to explain this thing so i'm happy that you to uh you could ask and solve these uh dots right so well if there is nothing else then we can say have a good weekend Carlos. okay thank you even uh, okay you. thank you very much okay have good a good night, weekend teacher. thank okay, you okay bye